Alright guys, so I know it's been a while since I've posted, but people have been asking me to make my Trade Ideas save files available for purchase, even though I already went over the nuts and bolts of all of my alerts in my public videos. So even though I've, I've already kind of covered all of my alerts for free, a number of you guys, you just you don't want to deal with having to reverse engineer them and you just want the save files so you can get up and running within a few minutes and that's fine um, so I went ahead and I made my trade ideas save files available on my website for purchase if you want to get up and running very quickly rather than having to try and reverse engineer all of my alerts from my prior videos on YouTube now I just want to give you a quick rundown of what you'll be getting. What you see here is most of the alerts that you'll be getting. Okay, not all of them, but most of them. There's just too many to fill in one window, but I just put the main ones here. So, of course, you'll be getting a top percent gainers. This is just your standard top percent gainers that you would see in any sort of scanner software and it's ordered by change from the previous close but you can also double click here and uh, order it from change from the open if you prefer it's up to you so this next one is my main scanner this is the the high of day with a float of less than 180 million so this is like a wide net scanner this will catch everything that moves basically but it also filters out a lot of noise okay so it took me maybe 15 months to fine-tune this scanner so that it picks up every single runner on the day but it also filters out a lot of noise so you're not constantly hearing any little stock that moves up 0.01 percent or something like that um, so it's a great scanner this is my main scanner and it's part of my my daily trading use now note with this scanner I do use text-to-speech as you see here the default is text-to-speech so this will testing as you hear it will actually play the name of the ticker however all of my other alerts they use a custom sound okay so it's only my catch-all alert that uses the text-to-speech whereas all of these other alerts they have a custom sound associated with them and that's just to distinguish the alert based on the sound okay otherwise you'll be hearing a barrage of text-to-speech and you won't know what scanner is going off okay so the sound is just a way to distinguish each alert so this next one is my big mover scanner this just alerts to any big mover on the day okay and by the way this is the sound that you will hear when that one goes off this is good um, for just tracking the big movers particularly if you want to short if you're tracking the ones you want to short this is similar to the big movers this only alerts you to the biggest movers on the day now it's sort of redundant um, you don't really need a scanner like this but I use it as well this next one is a block trades scanner this is a very very important scanner um, this will alert you to any trade larger than forty thousand dollars okay this is critical I went over this I went over most of my alerts in prior videos okay I, and I encourage you to watch those videos but again as I said in prior videos this is so so important to being able to know which stocks have the big players in them and which ones are being manipulated that will appear here in your block trade scanner and this is the sound that you'll hear on any large block trade okay this next one is my plummeting scanner and like the name suggests it will alert you to any stock that is falling hard and fast on the day okay so this is great for dip buying 
uh, dip buying those panic cells if that's your strategy. And this is the sound that you'll hear with this one. Okay. This next one is my Halt Resume Scanner. Very straightforward. It just alerts you to any stock that has been halted or resumed. And this is the sound. Okay. This next one is my Sector Scanner. Um, so this is like the wide net scanner, but it only alerts you to a stock within a certain sector that you specify, okay? And the default sector is China, okay? So any China stocks that are moving on the day will be alerted in this alert. And this is the sound that you'll hear. Sector. Okay. And by the way, you can easily change the sector. You just go to configure and symbol lists okay so right now it's china but you can change that to basically whatever you want there's hundreds of different lists that are built into trade ideas and you can choose whatever you want from that list okay very easy this next one is a multi-day runner scanner now this is a more recent scanner that I created just a couple months ago, um, so it's not in any prior video that I made, uh, but it is a very useful scanner that I like to track uh, multi-day runners. So any stock that is up big within a 10-day range, as you see here, and it's continuing on the current day, will be alerted in this window, okay? So basically, any stock that is on a multi-day run will be alerted here, okay? So if tracking multi-day runners is your thing, is part of your toolbox, then this is a great scanner to use. Um, high of day nearing $1. So this next one will alert you to any stock that is breaking out and it's nearing $1, okay? And this is only useful for when those $1 breaks are in play, which is not very often. Um, so they come and go. Um, so it has limited usefulness, but it's there if you want it. Okay. This will alert you to any IPO, any recent IPO or new listing. Okay. So this is great if you like to trade recent IPOs, this will alert you even on the day of the IPO. So for example, today it alerted um, ZVIA and as you can see here, this is ZVIA. It, it's an IPO from today. Okay. So, and it alerted at 1230, which was the time that it opened. Okay. So great scanner if that is your strategy. Nearing 52 week highs. So this will alert you to any stock that is nearing its 52 week high. Note, not breaking out from the 52 week high. Okay, and that's an, that's an important distinction because most other scanners, they only will tell you if a stock breaks the 52 week high. But by that time, it's already too late, okay? Um, and so this alert will actually tell you if a stock is 90% or higher of its 52-week high, okay? Um, and, it's, and it's moving up, all right? So that's a great scanner for anticipating and getting forewarning of a 52-week high break, if that's your strategy. So this next one is a dip by scanner. So this will alert you to any stock that is up big on the day, but at the same time, it's also cracking and, and falling hard, okay? The next one, this next one is a consolidating scanner, and this will alert you to any stock whose range is narrowing, okay? Which is basically what a consolidation is. This next one is a reversal scanner. Um, and like the name suggests, 
any stock that appears to be making a reversal will be alerted here. And by the way, I don't use this one as much, um, so it may need some tweaks uh, based on the current market that we're in. I haven't used that one in a while. And the, the consolidating one I haven't used in a while either. Um, this next one is a fresh pump scanner. So I, I used to use this a lot when I was a long bias trader, um, when those fresh pumps were often in play. And this will alert you to any low float pump that is just beginning its run. Okay, so it's, it's a very sensitive scanner um, because it, it picks up very low volume. Uh, but it also filters out a lot. And it took me a while to to really fine tune this scanner. And if I was still a long bias trader, it would definitely be still be part of my toolbox. So this next one will alert you to any stock that finished strong on the prior day and is also beginning to run up today on the current day. Okay. And so this, this is kind of similar to the multi-day runner, but this one, this one will give you more forewarning of a multi-day runner. Okay. So a stock that is just beginning a multi-day run, it will alert you in this scanner. Okay. This next one is finished week yesterday and what like the name suggests any stock that finished week on the day but appears to be bouncing on the current day uh, will be alerted here so again helpful for those dip buys if that's your part of your toolbox and that is a quick rundown of most of my scanners um, like I said, not all of them are here, but this this is pretty much most of them, okay? And again, um, I go over much of the nuts and bolts on my YouTube channel in prior videos, but for those of you who just want to get up and running with my save files directly, you can now do so on my website, all right? So that's gonna be it for this video. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Um, everything should be pretty straightforward. And by the way, I also include a an express installation for those of you who don't want to deal with setting up the custom formulas um, in Trade Ideas. I will actually uh, do all of the installation for you um, if you want. But again, I have to charge a fee only because of the time that it requires of me okay all right guys so feel free to reach out to me on twitter if you have any questions or you can contact me through my website as well okay all right guys take care